Some shocking news in women's college basketball as Gino Oriyama tested positive for COVID-19 on Sunday, March 14th. Now the Huskies were scheduled to travel to San Antonio for the NCAA tournament on Tuesday. I believe the team will still travel just without Oriyama. He must remain in isolation per CDC guidelines for about 10 days. We'll see how this impacts uh, the Huskies' schedule in the tournament and whether or not Gino can coach in the later rounds. For sure, he'll miss the first round. The second round, though, is scheduled for the 23rd and 24th, so if the Huskies play on the 24th, there's a chance that Gino could be coaching. However, uh, the one thing that the Huskies have on their side is associate head coach Chris Daly. She has been around this program just as long as Gino has. She's won just as many national championships as a coach. And she's actually had to step in and coach the Huskies in Gino's absence five different times, leading the team to a 10 and 0 record. So you feel good about where the team stands without Gino, even though this is really awful timing. You know, the team hasn't had a, a positive test within the program since way back at the start of the season. They thought that they were in the clear. That's obviously not the case. And even though Gino has had a second dose of the vaccine, clearly uh, not fully immune just yet. And of course, it's Selection Monday, so we'll see where the seating lies for UConn. This is a, a total wrench in their plans, but they could be just fine.